A warning tonight for homeowners in parts of Poland Township after six cars were broken into this weekend. Now, police say the suspects made off with hundreds of dollars in items, but it's the damage that was left behind that has investigators most concerned. Here's 27 First News reporter Amanda Smith. Every summer, police expect a certain amount of theft from auto crimes, but this year, suspects are stepping it up a notch. A little different this time is, uh, you know, they're starting to break more windows. FBI data shows the township averages about 60 property crimes a year, and that hasn't changed. The chief says the crimes are just getting more serious. That means people responsible are causing several hundred dollars of damage for items of little value. They're looking for anything of value that they can get. Uh, and again, it, to them, it could be a couple of dollars sitting in a change jar. It could end up to, you know, two dollars, but they'll break a window that's going to cost them a couple hundred dollars to fix. Neighborhoods off of Dobbins Road were targeted. The thief might have targeted this area because it was relatively well to do. But once they started on one side of the street, let me show you how they could just bounce from house to house to house, hitting easy targets along the way. Thieves got wallet, purses, ID cards, and even a loaded handgun. Now police say they have a video of the thieves from a house security camera and a cigarette butt he dropped. But the pictures might be too blurry to use. As I tell people when they ask, should we buy cameras, if you're going to spend the money to put a camera up, make sure it's me like looking at you today. That, you know, when I see somebody walking at night, that you can tell who they are. The police will take any leads they can get. In Poland Township, Amanda Smith, WKBN 27 First News.